Hello, my name is Madeline Bracken, executive coach for Achieve Today. I come to you today from the beautiful city of Skagway, Alaska, overlooking the ocean right outside of town. I have to say, as I sit here, I am overwhelmed with gratitude. It's an absolutely beautiful day in a place where usually it's very, very rainy. But when I started thinking about that, of being so grateful for today when it's not raining, it made me start thinking of gratitude in general of how grateful I was for today as opposed to maybe yesterday when it was raining. And then it started me, it caused me to ponder this idea of making gratitude lists and how many times we get caught up in being grateful for things as opposed to just having a grateful disposition. And there's a very large difference. If we get into the habit of being grateful for things, we might find ourselves being more grateful when times are easy as opposed to when maybe we're experiencing some tribulations or trials, which really isn't how gratitude works. We should learn how to be gratitude in, be grateful in any circumstance. There's an amazing story I know that I once heard from a wise man about a waiter. This waiter served, served a certain gentleman. Every day after dinner, he would ask this gentleman, how did you like your food? Every day the man would answer the same thing. Oh, it was fine as usual, but you guys don't serve enough bread. The next day, this waiter was determined he would please this man. So he brought double the bread, so brought two slices instead of four. Again, after the meal, he said, how did you like your meal? The man replied, oh, it was great, but still enough, not enough bread. The next day, he doubled the amount of bread he was giving this man, only to have the same reply. It was good, but not enough bread. And so finally, determined the very next day, this waiter brought, bought a nine foot loaf of bread in which he cut in half and delivered to the man's table. Waiting with anticipation for this man to finish his dinner, he asked, how did you like your meal? Again, the man replied, oh, it was fine, but as usual, but I see you're back to only serving two slices of bread. Though this story is funny, it, it, it demonstrates a very important point. Sometimes we get so uh, caught up in what we're grateful for, we forget of the fact that sometimes it's okay just to have gratitude in our being. And how do you accomplish this? How do you, can you find gratitude even when circumstances are hard? This comes from faith. This comes from having faith in the things that are going on around, having faith that even if things are tough right now, they will get better because they will. When we have this faith and this gratitude as a disposition, this makes times like with disappointment, depression, and despair a little bit more bearable. It gives them purpose and meaning. So many times we wait for the rainbow when really we should just be grateful that there's rain. So what would I recommend today? Be grateful. Be grateful in any circumstances because this is the way you will achieve today.